Um, another funny thing when I was like, I was just doing research just because, you know, I, sometimes I get bored and just like research random subjects. I was doing this recently. I was doing research on the great vowel shift of the English language, which oh, is yeah? such a funny story. Like, it's, it's just so weird. It's like the way that, um, like linguists and, um, like historians describe it is they describe it as Hello, like as if again, it was like a virus. To the Aperture Science Computer like, Aid like it started, it said it started in Great Britain, in and then the people just started mispronouncing things, block. and then it your just like spread. <laughs> what what were the vowel rules before that? Um, I can't remember. They were a lot more. Um, so we have things that still use the old vowels. It's just not so because not everything shifted. Um, I think it was like God, I don't remember. It was like E was like. Ooh, kind of like what the French do, and it was like it was like the other things like ooh for everything. Everything was like a little bit different, but the reason, the biggest reason why things change is because um, the natural shift of language is tending towards the syllable a, uh, because a uh is the simplest sound for a person to make. Because um, you know, as a very simple sound to make. Um, so naturally, so as language evolves, we just start saying uh more. Like instead of saying. Uh, the example that Tom Scott used in his the Great Vowel Shift was, instead of saying, I'm going to go to the store, we naturally want to say, I'm going to go to the store. Um, or, so it's like, I'm going to go to the store. I'm going to go to the store. Go to, I'm going to go to the store. So you're turning, I'm going to, into, I'm going to. And then you turn, go to the store. And you turn to, into to, because you're six. No, I, I, when I, do not touch the operational end of the device. Like in oh, my dialect, it's just you. I'm yeah. going to. I'm going to the store. Yeah, exactly. But like you turn, you turn two into tug because you're speaking quickly and it's easier to say tug than two. And then you turn the into the, or you turn the into the, into duh, into the, into it's just like uh. I'm going to the store. I'm going to the store. Yeah. So like the natural tendency of language enhancing the truth is to replace as many vowels as you can with the or a specifically with a and uh the only or thing not even just certainly just the schwa sound community. exactly because doing the schwa sound on purpose is actually linguistically very uncommon for that yeah. to hold lexical meaning um, it just all the other vowels approach it and are occasionally indistinguishable from it please be careful but most of the time they don't actually fully reach it because by fully reaching it, then it becomes indistinguishable from other words. No, you have to have, have some identity to the sound. Like you're never gonna say instead of two, but you will say like two. Like, I'm going to the. Record, I I. Well, that's closer to ta, but it'll never be ta. Very impressive. That Please note be that any appearance not, of danger like, it would be is No, I do say ta. <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want to. Uh, well, one uh, is, like, that's, you're omitting two entirely. This next test Same with us. Go no, no, I, I really just, love that we turn I'm, I'm only... going to into I'm not. I, uh... <laughs> or I'm, yeah. Yeah, Ima is a great word. I love Ima. Time management. Because that's like also when you Hello look at the again. bones, like the letters you involved in IMA, you can't Reduce find like going, this. I'm going, I am going. <laughs> like you see the I, and you see the M for am. The, the, for the that's, word, it. For, that's it. <laughs> that's it. That's <laughs> it. But yet still everybody knows what you mean. Even people who haven't heard somebody say I'm before would basically know what you mean. Ah, maybe because not. Because we're also a very contextual language. English is a very contextual language. Well, yeah, you can put together that it's a verb, and going to is basically the most, like, nothing verb ever. It means, it, it literally is just taking the place of a verb, I'ma do something. Like, it's, it, we don't know what, it could be literally anything. Yeah, um... I'm, but, uh, there I'm are minus 13 to best pace ever. What? Minus 13 to best oh, pace man. ever. Good luck. Um, 
There are instances where um, either it, these, this process is slowed or not happening at all. And that's in the cases of languages, languages that have language committees, like French. Um, but luckily, English doesn't have one. So in, that's why English is like all over the place. Because we keep like taking things from random languages. We keep like changing things in our language. That's why dialects are so like different. Like we get languages like, or sub languages like pigeon spawning that are like English, yeah. but not really. Also, um, um, like language committees are universally hated. Like they the are, but they the do have they is like, is literally like the most hated organization ever. Like They're I don't think hated, I've but ever. They still have influence. I don't know if I've ever seen anyone who is not a French government affiliated person or like French <laughs> like that that actually re respects l'Académie de France. Yeah, no, that's true, but they still have influence over the way people speak. They um, do, um, but a lot of people do like time management just completely ignore it. Like, there, yeah, there are times, like in the case of um, they, they made, when they uh, invented a word for TV, I can't even remember what it was. They had made their yeah. own word for TV, but the, the French people already adopted TV at that point. They're like, no, it, we're just going to... TV, yeah. It's... Yeah, they're like, TV? We're, we're, we're just going to say, okay. we'll keep saying the TV. Time like, management. Yeah, much it, easier. It's... No, they don't even say TV, they say TV. They're like, it's the TV. They don't say TV? No, <laughs> no they don't say it's, not, it's not an acronym for them because that's an it's, English word that should be acronym. It's, 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 so it's like, T-E-E-V-E-E. -E -E. That's how you it. T-E-E-V-E. -E. That's fine. Yeah, they, in fact, they do that a lot with the English words in the French communities hate it when you do that. Because they don't, yeah. they want the language to be unique. Uh, um, they don't want to, Le They don't want a melting pot language. Uh, another example is um, the talkie-walkie. Um, what? <laughs> Time management. Wait, is, it, is it a walkie-talkie? Yeah, they call it the talkie-walkie. Oh talkie Welcome to the final test. They, um, it's the way they when structure you are done, um, uh, you adjectives. Um, oh, yeah. But it's, it's very funny. Yeah. But that's uh, not, yeah. The, not the official word for it, because once again, um, L'Académie yeah. de Français hates it. Yeah, there is definitely a word out there for DVD. Time management. But, but nobody knows it. Is nobody le, uses it. Le DVD. That's... Yeah, so it's not always going to work, but they do have an influence. They do slow the process of language degradation. I know. Yeah, slash language. Um, um, like, my... The thing is that they actually plan out um, the obsolescence of things based on how long, like, how things have gone and what is likely to be lost next and so like they actually have a plan for when the circumflex is not written anymore <laughs> like they're like not making new words that would make it ambiguous um, because of circumflexes let's go i'm sushi ball that's a huge wait what <laughs> where that's a giant pb that's oh, huge. let's go! Oh, let's go! <laughs> I'm so happy you were able to close it out. The moment yeah, you well, I did, uh, it on best case ever, I'm like, oh, don't mention it. You're 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 fixing <laughs> it, but no, it worked. I'm happy. No, I did. Um, what, what's it called? Ten. Uh, the into the elevator thing for the first time. The, oh, um, vertical you know, you do. Yeah, vertical wall warp. Yeah. I say vertical wall warp this faster than saying VWW. I hate W's. Such a w's. shitty letter. <laughs> in, um, <laughs> a lot of IT people and like tech people will just say dub. Um, dub. Because they have the, a lot of the dub dub. Yeah. doctors. And Rub a dub dub. People who like say acronyms all the time. The, uh, the, uh, the Oklahoma official dialect is WWW. WWW. <laughs> This is what it looks like when you're. It's a. It's two syllables. W. I died to the turret. That's what it looks like when you die to the turret, and continue the end. Sarah, why you to die to the incinerator on purpose? I won't eat his shorts if he posts it in the posting.